Maple System Series 5000 HMIs have many different options to help manufacturers protect their custom projects. This video will explain some of the options available for intellectual property protection. In the system parameters under the edit menu, you will find many different settings that will help protect your custom projects. Under the general tab at the bottom, you will find a section called project protection. If you check this checkbox and enable this option, you will have a project key field pop up. Here you can set a project key which will allow the project to run only if the HMI key is the same. To set the HMI key, write the key to system tag LW9046. This will store the key in non-volatile memory. This allows the manufacturer the ability to maintain control over replacement HMIs and system support. If we go back to the System Parameters menu, under the System Settings tab, there are several features that can be used to protect your custom project. The Hide System Setting Bar option will hide the System Setting button on the HMI, keeping the user out of the HMI Settings menu. Once this checkbox is checked and the project is downloaded to the HMI, the only way to turn the system setting button back on is to uncheck this box and re-download the project. The other way to hide the system setting button is to toggle dip switch number 2 on the back of the HMI to the on position. This can be turned off at any time. On the system settings tab, there is also an option to disable upload function. This keeps the user from being able to upload the project. Another way to keep the user from uploading the project is to set the upload password in the HMI system settings under the security tab. This will make it so a password is needed in order to upload the project. There is also an option to put in a download password. This makes it so a password would be needed to download the project. Next, if we go to the security tab, there is an option to password protect the project. If this is checked, you can go into the settings and input a password. This password would then be needed to open the MTP file. I'm just going to show you that real quick. It's asking for a password to open the MTP file. Another way to protect your project is to restrict unauthorized decompiling. This is done in the compile window. If you click the set button next to XOB password, you can set a password that the project will need before decompiling. You can also prohibit decompiling altogether by checking the decompilation is prohibited checkbox. Another thing that's easy to use is the Easy Downloader Utility. This software is free and can be found at our website at www.maplesystems.com. Under the Support Center tab, you'll find Demo Software. About the third one down is the EasyWare Downloader Utility. The EasyWare Downloader Utility allows users to download a project without allowing them to modify the project file. This utility includes Easy Converter, Easy Printer, Easy Simulator, Project Manager, and Recipe Editor. This can be a very useful tool in intellectual property protection. For more information, visit our website. Under the Support Center tab, you'll find technical notes, sample projects, and a video center to give you an idea of the features we offer and what the Maple Systems HMI can do for you.